All right, guys, we're at it again. In the review video, today we're gonna do the Blink Outdoor uh, cameras. I have another one of these that comes uh, came with a module too, but the one I have out there has um, solar power. It still takes batteries, but it's supposed to have like a solar power um, <clears throat> kit that lets it recharge them. Can't say it works 100%, but you know, I don't think it might get, be getting enough sunlight either. Uh, this one has a two year battery life. Or so they say. I'm not bashing on them, but uh, me, I think it's about a six months, and I gotta change them. And I use the rechargeable uh, lithium batteries. There's a video done on those. They're weather resistant, true. A day and night, true. Two way audio, motion detection, yeah. Now you can store it on a USB drive using the SIG module too, or you pay the fee for the subscription. This is what it looks like outside. Um, yeah, so the features, I mean, the camera's pretty good. I'm not gonna complain about it. I like it. The only thing I don't like is that it does not, um, uh, what's it called? It's not constantly recording. It's more a motion detection recording. So if it doesn't detect motion, it's not recording. You can watch it live, whether there's motion or not. You get on the phone, on, the, on your app, but it's not constantly recording. That's the only thing I didn't like about it. But then again, it probably would take about my USB. But yeah, if you're looking for something that's uh, constantly recording, this ain't it. This one only detects motion and records. Instruction manual. Here's the module. Um, if you have a USB, you format it, you insert it in here. And instead of paying the fee, it saves it all in there. It takes a little longer to load, but uh, you know, saves the money. Comes with a USB cord, a base for the module. And this is to uh, take off the back of the cameras. There we go. Like so, there's a little cover right here. You use this to, you use this to um, put the box down first. You use this to unscrew this. And then right here's a USB charging port. Once you unscrew this, if I get it to work, oh, that's wrong. So once you unscrew this, you should see the access port for the cameras, for the batteries. The batteries, you should see the access port for the cameras, batteries, there we go. And there's a charger, same thing, lithium only. You gotta scan this to connect them. And it does come with the batteries included. They give you the Energizer Ultimate Lithium. So they will last a long time, but it also depends how much, how um, sensitive your settings are for motion detection. How, so a lot of it has to play on that. You know, how often they turn back on, how long they record it, um, stuff like that. So it comes with these mounts right here. This one goes into the camera. Into the camera's bag. There you go. So, they do swivel. You can move the camera however you want. This one I got a two pack because it was on sale Amazon Prime Day. And see it comes with these screws. It's pretty simple to install. You just put the screws here, wherever you want it on the wall. And then once you put that on, snap the camera on. The two-way radio is pretty loud. It's not crazy loud, but they can hear you. You can hear them. Um, the, the video HD is pretty, the quality is pretty good. Um, there's another, another camera with another, another um, mount. Like I said right here, use the included top. Use the included tool to unscrew it back. But yeah, guys, that's it. I'll put some videos and maybe some pictures afterwards when I mount them. Like I said, I have another one. And I'll show you the quality so you guys can see it there. Is it worth the money? Honestly, it is. Um, the only downfall, like I said, is um, it doesn't. It's not a constant record. So I'll put the link in the description so you guys can check it out. And I'll sh I'll add some videos of day and night, and um, so you guys can check out the quality. All right.